Good morning everyone, this is Jeannie and welcome to my channel. I've had several requests from my friends lately to show you how I organize things around my house. Now, I am not a professional organizer. I, I'm not. I wish I could be though. But anyhow, I'm just going to show you <laughs> how I organize a few things around my house. So this series, and I'll have it in a playlist, is how I organize my kitchen drawers. So we'll start there. And uh, throughout the series, I'm just going to um, figure out what other ideas I have to share with you uh, in how I organize many different areas of my house just to make it more but a little bit I easier. hope you enjoy this video and I'll see you later. Well, I have nine drawers in my kitchen and I thought I would just show you how I organize my drawers. The first one is right next to the refrigerator and I know it looks kind of messy but it really isn't. I have three different containers in here. I have one for my spatulas and slippers, one for my slotted spoons and soup dipping spoons. Then these right in the middle are the really long soup spoons that don't really fit straight or in any of these containers, so I just angled everything. They just stay right here in the middle and it keeps it neat and clean and organized. I always know where to go for these long handled spoons. And then this one is just my uh, tur turkey basters and back here I keep all of my onion cutters that I absolutely love. So that's this spoon drawer. And then right next to my oven I have my wooden spoons drawer. And I love these bamboo spoons. I use them for cooking. I never usually use steel or metal spoons when I cook and stir. I love using these wooden bamboo spoons. The drawer next to the sink is my pot holder drawer. And I just clean these regularly. In the back I have my crocheted um, scrubbers that I love. I love using those. So everything is nice and clean and kept right here next to the sink. On the left, right side, I keep all of my towels and little dishcloths. I get these at Target and I usually decorate with black in my kitchen. I feel like, um, I feel like it really matches everything. <clears throat> and this is a towel that I got from my girlfriend for my birthday. I love it. Um, and I do use it. I have used it. I love it. So thank you for that towel. That's where I keep my dishcloth and dish towel. Now, this is just a regular silverware drawer. And then I have a bank of four drawers right here. Now this first one, I bought these little containers at the Dollar Tree and everything is organized. I don't have any junk drawers, but this might look junky. I'm not sure to you, but I keep little command hooks, cement, nails, my little hammer, a wine opener, and then I keep my plastic right in this one, my bag clips, scoops, I have some of these little fast food condiments and then other little things that I try to just keep organized. I need them. I know exactly where they are. The drawer below be, uh, it, I have my salad tongs on the right, an egg beater in case the electricity goes out, <coughs> my whisks, can openers, pizza cutters, my measuring spoons, and then my plastic little whips and whisks and spatulas right there. So I love being organized. This drawer is a little bit bigger and I need to fill it up, but this is the drawer that my grandchildren are allowed to go into. It has snacks. They're allowed to go into this drawer and rummage through it and see what they can find to eat. I have so many rules here when they're here, so um, 
I don't mind if they pull this out and just see what's in there for a snack. And they're welcome to eat whatever they want. As you can see, it's getting low, so I need to fill it up again. And <coughs> the last drawer that I have is my paper products drawer. In this tub, I keep my straws for the kids and my um, garbage bag bags. And then I keep my slow cooker liners. These are amazing. I love using those. I keep my aluminum foil, which I don't use as much anymore, and parchment paper, saran wrap, zipper bags, wax paper, and sandwich bags right here. So that is my paper drawer right on the bottom. Very organized, very nice. And thank you guys for joining me to see what I keep in the drawers in my kitchen. I'll see you in the next organizational video very soon.